Hi there, uh, my name is Lindsay. I'm a part-time reseller on Poshmark and also The Real Real. And I post mystery unboxing videos every Monday and Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern. So if you enjoy mystery unboxings, reselling content, please consider subscribing. Don't forget to hit the like button and also the bell notification for me. Um, so I do love sourcing my inventory from ThreadUp, the Goodwill Blue Box, and also America's Thrift Supply. And um, today is no exception. I do have a thread up unboxing, and this one came from Swanee, Georgia, and it's a fun box. The box arrived in pretty poor condition, and it's fairly light, so hopefully nothing is damaged in there, and we got some decent items. Um, lately, the best warehouse for fun boxes seems to be Phoenix, Arizona. Um, the last, um, couple I've gotten from there were really good and I had coach in all of those boxes. Um, but hopefully Georgia will not disappoint. I ordered this one pretty recently on September 12th and they run $32 plus tax for 10 items. Sometimes you get more, but, um, usually Georgia is exactly 10. I did put some air pillows in here, and at first glance, I see something um, kind of decent in there. So here's a first look for you. We do have a coach wristlet. Um, you know, not the best um, style, but it looks like it's in good condition. Just the canvas CC monogram, and then it has leather trim. And um, it looks like it's in good shape. There's um, just a black fabric interior, no markings or anything. So that's pretty nice. At least it's in good shape. Um, you know, can probably list that for 20 bucks or so. I will have to look into comps. Next we have some Snugadoo socks and this pretty pink and purple and blue. They kind of look like a aloe type sock. Um, one size, really soft. And we do have a YSL beauty case, and this is actually new with the tag. Um, so it looks like this was just a free gift with purchase, but it does even have the little wrapper on the zipper. Very smooth zipper. Not the largest case in the world, but um, you know, nice size if you're gonna put some makeup brushes or something in there. Um, so that's actually nice. I don't know how much that might go for, but love the brand. Uh, we have some Nordstrom trouser socks, um, just some fishnet trouser socks. These retailed um, three for 30 or $12 each. So um, those could certainly be listed. They're not going to go for much. And next I have a pair of sweater tights from Morona brand. I believe these are sold at Kohl's. They're a medium. And um, I don't see a original price on them, but probably can list for 10 or 15. So at least they're a thicker tight. Somebody might want those for fall. And I've got a scarf here with some bees on it. That's kind of cute. Um, and it is um, Love Victoria, possibly. And unfortunately, there was a take here that's cut out. It does feel like silk. So um, I will have to use a Google lens to see what the brand might be. I don't know if it's possibly Victoria Beckham. This is the um, signature here. So, you know, that's really nice. Um, unfortunately, when they don't have the branding tag though, it can be difficult to resell. That's what happened with that Hermes teddy bear scarf. I don't know if you guys remember, I unboxed that a couple months ago. Unfortunately, the branding tag was removed. So, um, you know, a lot of places like the Real Real and such aren't willing to take it. 
Um, but this feels really nice, like it is silk and nice quality. Um, so I don't know, this is a really good box so far. Next we have a new belt and it is a faux leather and I don't see any brand on it. Um, just a light brown and it looks fairly small. So that's probably not something that will be, um, you know, listable just with no brand. A couple more things here. Looks like we have a jewelry item. This is a long silver tone tassel necklace. And it's kind of silver link all the way through with this knot in the middle. And that's Chico's. So great um, jewelry brand. And um, yeah, this is impressive. I, I like this. Um, I do have quite a few Chico's pieces um, listed currently in my closet. So that will be a nice addition and definitely something that should sell. Um, next, I have some headbands, a 10 pack. And these I also don't see any brand on, but there is 10 of them. So that might be something I can list. And our last item is also new, um, Secret Treasures, I believe is Walmart. Um, they're a size medium and just really fuzzy um, lounge pants. They have the little fabric um, around the ankle, just kind of like a teddy bear material, really soft. So um, excellent, excellent box from Georgia. I'm very happy with this one. Um, we had the pants for one. We had the two pair of tights, the sweater tights, two, three with the trouser socks. We had four with the Chico's necklace. Get that put up before something happens to it. We had five with the headbands, six with the belt, seven with this really nice scarf, eight with the YSL beauty case, nine with the socks, and 10 with the coach wristlet. So really good. This box will no doubt be a profit, so I'm very happy. Um, let me know what your favorite item was. I guess mine would probably be the scarf and that YSL case. Um, I appreciate you tuning in and I'll see you back soon with another video. Take care.